The reason I am saying these things is I recognize if we are going through this month and my saying, why church? The easiest inclination in my own heart and the expected answer is say, well, we come to church so that we will be spiritually fed and comforted and inspired and encouraged. All of those are good and true answers and entirely insufficient. Because ultimately, if you are here for you, I will tell you what is happening. You will grow spiritually dry or disappointed or be hurt. And at some point, you will feel there is no reason to be here. I just want to be honest with you. I mean, if I talk about loving the bride of Christ, I I know as well as anybody how hard that is. For three decades of my life, I was in at least 50 churches a year. I think of what that means. You know, 1,000, 1,500 churches I have been in. If I have experienced the privilege and the pain of being in the church, I will tell you, it is extensive. I have never been more inspired than when I have been in the church, and I have never been more ashamed than when I have been in the church. I have never experienced greater courage when I've been in the church or seen greater despicable hypocrisy. I have never been more joyous or more deeply hurt than when in the church. And I say that to you because I recognize that when I'm calling people to be members of a part of the body of Christ, I'm ultimately saying, if you're just saying, what will this do for me? You'll find you want to leave. I have wanted to leave a thousand times and been called back a thousand times, not because of the beautiful features of the church, because of the beautiful purpose of the church. What is the purpose of the church? It is to bring glory to the Savior. It is that the nations may know him. It is that the children may know him. It is not so that we will get our own. It is not so that we will have what we most want. If we are doing the work of Jesus Christ, we begin to identify the hurting people and the miserable churches that actually need godly people to help them. Because God is calling his church to glorify him. If you're not a member of any church, if you are a lapsed member of this church, if you are on the sidelines of the mission of God, I want you to think that through again. Don't buy the consumerism that says you need to find a perfect church to satisfy your needs. I urge you to find a church that is so messed up and miserable, it needs you. A church like this. 